Well, if it isn't time to slap your mother, romance your sister, and elect a man who's got no business in politics into the highest government office in the country, ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to another episode of my Chuck Freedom Career Mode. Episode 2, and we are finally getting started in the MLS. The Invitational Cup is over and done with. The Portland Timbers are our first match, but not for me. I'm being left on the bench. Unbelievable stuff. So, Ibrahimovic will go up front for this one. He didn't play in the Invitational Cup. Let's see how he does here. How well will they do without me? <gasps> they go behind on 15 minutes. It's not looking good for the Galaxy. They need a little bit of freedom, I think, injected, but uh, we're not going to get it. Oh, we go down 2 0. What the hell is going on here? Unbelievable stuff. 3-0, 3-1. Well, if the uh, if the top dog doesn't put me in after this, I don't know what. Well, he would do, and we would only get a draw at New York City away from home. Nothing to show you highlight-wise. We did get a 6.1. I mean, we start on a 6. So, I mean, as you can imagine, it's not really that much of an improvement, if I'm brutally honest with you. Really bad. Uh, no shooting and only 52% passing. So, another game without freedom. Unbelievable. But Ibra Ibrahimovic does get a goal on 10 minutes. And Ashley Cole, the uh, left back for the Galaxy, formerly of Chelsea fame, gets a yellow card there. Into the second half now. Kamara, there we go. There we go. It's tied up now. 2-2. Come on, boys. Time to get a winner. Time to get a winner. Surely. Pushing on through now, guys. And, ah, oh, unbelievable. 90 minutes rolls around and it is 2-2. A stuttery start to the season. Surely they have to get me in, and they do. There he is, Chuck Freedom, making his MLS debut at home at the StubHub Center. The whole reason I chose the LA Galaxy, and what a game it will be to start off with. Ladies and gentlemen, you are going to witness the very first battle for LA. That's right. <laughs> it's LA versus LA here. It really is. It's the Bloods and the Crips. That's what's happening here, folks. It's, it's not. That causes people to die. This is just a silly game of football. So here we go, Chuck Freedom. Oh, look at that. A lovely little pass round here. Really getting away from the defender. Oh, it's taken off of us there. Really, really bad. My first touch is appalling in this game at the moment, but we will work on it. So the cross comes in. It's fisted away by the keeper there. What are they going to do now? It looks like a LA Galaxy playing with a lot of freedom here. We play the ball in now. All the way through to Ibra. And oh my God, it's a lovely goal. We didn't really have much of a hand in the uh, actual setup. We just kind of knocked it around and opened up a bit of space. Got some uh, defenders interested in us, lured them in, then uh, found that pass. The LA fans are absolutely loving it. Um, they're, they're, Chuck Freedom is trying to not to touch any of like the Mexican players in there because, as his hero Donald Trump says, they're all murderers and rapists, all of them. A few of them are good, but majority of them are. So, from a corner awfully placed it's it should be freedom taking them so here we go we strike the ball with gusto but it deflects for a corner there we go and uh, freedom there holding his uh, his head in his hands there he's just looked at the rate of uh, illegal immigrants apparently voting in the last election that's how upset he is so after that after that first half one nil the battle for la is uh, halfway through and we've we've done quite well so uh, a 6.6 .6 rating at half time there two green uh, plus points and uh, two red thumbs down so uh, we are losing possession a lot we'd like to see some more shots on target as well i'd like to be the Eden Hazard of LA if we can make that happen so Kamara with a lovely ball four we're gonna play it in to Ibra and surely and it is his second goal we get our first assist in the MLS as well folks it is all looking really good I thought that maybe Maybe the Invitational Cup was just a, a a bit of a fluke. Maybe people weren't trying, but it looks like we can dominate this league as long as the rest of the teams are as lacklustre as the other LA side. Ebro with a lovely clinical finish there. So 2-0 on 68 minutes. And there's that space. There's that space that Freedom needs. Freedom running, sprinting, and it's a lovely finish. There we go. 
Freedom for all, ladies and gentlemen. Beautiful stuff. Our first goal in the MLS. Uh, Ibrahimovic comes over and says, listen, uh, you know, uh, this this is my team. I don't really want you scoring goals. But it's all about Chuck Freedom, ladies and gentlemen. Look at this. It was a lovely shot. Just dinked off the inside of the post. Wasn't quite as clean as we'd like it, but still not bad. 89 minutes, 3-0 up. They're not looking threatening at all, LA. Well, the other LA side, anyway. Freedom now. Look at this. All the way to the byline. Whips it in. Surely someone there there isn't and then it is absolutely skied over oh my days that was so close to finding the back of the net there but there we have it first blood to the galaxy lafc absolutely nothing about them ebra with two yours truly chuck freedom with one that's what we like to see there a bit of freedom 8.0 is our match rating. One goal, one assist, 80% passing, and we're now rated 73 overall. Nice bit of a heat signature on the right wing there, as you would expect. So, we completed every goal except our pass completion rate. We fell well short of that. Uh, only lost to the Portland Timbers. The rest of them were draws and then a win. So... Here we go, another huge game now, and uh, Sporting KC hopefully will be our next victims in the MLS, just the uh, just the league, not the cup, so here we go, Freedom cuts inside nicely, what can he do here, goes outside, looking for space, drills one, and the keeper more than equal to that patriotic shot right there, good god, it's like Hulk Hogan just kicked a bald eagle at someone it was that patriotic unbelievable stuff but without the racism and having sex with his friends on video so a 7.0 for nice passing now plays it through back post i don't think no we have not got the uh we did not get the credit for the assist there as i think it took a deflection off someone from kansas city but still we did the majority of the work there i'm sure that'll be acknowledged on sports center and espn tonight la fans once again fucking psycho and rabid in the stands there. I do like playing at the Stub Hub Centre, especially when it's sunny, not today's conditions, because it does look amazing. So, from the corner, Sporting KC now playing it in. Oh, it's an awful goal to concede. Defending is absolutely shocking. Ashley Cole should have been back defending that area with his life, and now Sporting KC think they're all that. Well, I, I hate to say it, Chuck Freedom will not be standing for that. He might not get you in this match, he'll get you in the next though he's going to go jump in his pickup truck open a can of Mountain Dew maybe slap his sister slash mother we don't quite know what he's going to do he's a proper redneck bastard here we go nice little touch there but oh god we cannot keep it away from the other players it seems we just give away possession way too early it is whipped in and that's Ibra to Kamara there it's a nice little connection these two have got and uh, yeah not so much anything involving Chuck Freedom on that occasion but still we go back ahead just before the break. So uh, well into uh, overtime now, injury time in the first half. Whistle should have gone a little while ago, if I'm honest with you. But still, we will take it. 2-1 at half time. Alessandrini and Kamara linking up very nicely there indeed. 26 touches with a 72% pass completion rate. And they love me. Four green thumbs up. Really nice stuff. Don't really progress back too much past the halfway line. We don't do a lot of defending in this game. It's all about attack, attack, attack. So, keeper commits himself. He makes a boo-boo and at the back post to clear to, to, to bang it in. Once again, we are just complete scumbags when it comes to getting goals. Just picking them off. Always first to the second ball. Alessandrini yet again. He gets his second of the day. And, uh, well... Chuck Freedom, very much a spectator in the second half here. We've got Kamara in the middle, who does look like the weekend. He does a lovely attempt at a little headed uh, effort there to try and loop over the keeper. More than equal to it. And then Alessandrini at the back post with uh, Freedom arriving late into the box. Never mind, though. We'll get there eventually. We'll start banging them in, I am sure. So uh, another goal for Alessandrini, making him our uh, joint top scorer, I believe with um, Ibrahimovic, so not bad at all. 85 minutes now, so not long to go. What have we got about ourselves now? Some uh, pa backwards passing now, but it's uh, done well. It's really opened up our defence here, and oh my god, Silvestri fortunately comes and claims it very nicely now. Clock still ticking. 
They're always going to try and look for a way of supporting KC. It's knocked around very nicely to DeSantos now. Giovanni has it cut out by uh, Zuzu there. Very well done indeed. But uh, what can we do here? He's going to look up for the long pass. We're going to try and cut it out the best we can. And there we go. Jameson now. Nicely done to Freedom. Chuck Freedom inside. Whips it in. And oh my God, Giovanni absolutely ruins what could have been a lovely move there. Good God, look at this. He cut inside a little bit early with his weaker foot, but it was offside. Never mind. Not bad nonetheless. Not bad at all. So, 90th minute, Chuck Freedom still playing quite far forward. Not really interesting in any defending at the moment in time, but uh, who knows? That might come back to really bite us in the arse. We've got to make sure that we keep our shape in this game as well because we've got a habit of wandering out of position here. We really do. Alessandrini to Giovanni to Jameson. Jameson, and it is all over. Sporting KC get an absolute fingering at the hands of Alessandrini today. Good God, he's been an absolute beast. I think that when Ibrahimovic does resign, resign? Uh, I mean, retire. I think we will be in good hands. How long will we stay at this club? I do not know. We tend to stay at a club for two seasons, and then we start to have offers come in for us. So, uh, hmm, could we go to the Premiership? Could we go to Spain, Italy? It, it's just, you know, really, the world is our oyster. We haven't actually got a passport. Chuck Freedom's family doesn't believe in passports because all you ever need to do is just stay in America. It's got it all there. We don't need to explore the world. Their globe at home has just got question marks over all the other countries. We move up a grade overall to 74 rated. And uh, we've we done well. We didn't get any goals or assists, but I think we really put in a good shift in that last game there. So, ladies and gentlemen, I think that's probably a good place to leave it for this one. Thank you so much for coming back, listening to my ramblings. If there's anything you think I'd like to add to the series, let me know in the comments below. Let me know what you think as well. And delight over freedom. <sighs> Isn't that the dream of any true American? Probably. I wouldn't know. I'm British. We're, we're not allowed that over here anymore. Ladies and gentlemen, I've been the Game Womble. And so long for now, folks.